Good day guys, this is Jay and welcome to the 13th episode of Keepsakes. This is the podcast uh, of yours truly. Uh, this is available anywhere. And uh, today we're going to discuss the World Cosplay Summit. It's just uh, ended earlier and we're recording this post-event. So I have with me Serena of the Lily Cat who has joined me in covering the WCS in Davao City when Team Philippines 2018 was selected there. Hi, Serena. Hello there, fam. Hello, and yes, this is your girl, Serena, from the Lily Cat. So, yeah. And it's good for, and thank you for inviting me, Jay, for in, in this podcast because I have some things also to spaz and share about related to the World Cosplay Summit. And this is the best so far. I I, I like this year's. Like, seriously. Mm, this is the biggest uh, World Cosplay Summit so far. And by the way, before we begin, congratulations on moving on to WordPress. Oh, uh, yeah, WordPress, yes. Uh, actually, recently, yeah, uh, I moved. Well, actually, a lot of things happened in the blog. So I migrated to a better host, and it's better now. And so it's now in a new home. And uh Actually, there are still lots of things that I need to transfer from the old one. But yeah, I'll get by. But everything's been going smoothly. And I'm actually very happy with actually maraming akong pending features and reviews, Jay. Kung makita mo lang yung drafts ko from, from the previous, from the previous, ano, yung, kasi yung previous blog was under Blogspot. Marami pala, marami pala akong, ano, I have like, 12 or 15 pending kasi yung iba halfway done yung iba walang conclusion and yung iba title lang so <laughs> i don't know pero yeah, most likely i'll be able to get my drafts fully published hopefully this year or by 2019 mm-hmm. so at least you have your kind of na uh, schedule mo na lang yun one by one 12 to 15 po say eh. buti ka pa uh, wait. Eh, ano ka ako well, I was thinking, what content should I write? Or rather, what event should I manage? <laughs> Dam- yeah, ganap yan. Daming ganap yan, that's real. Eh. Mm-hmm. So yeah, uh, again, congratulations. Now we start with our discussion post-World Cosplay Summit 2018. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, so Serena, uh, what's up? Uh, what, um, let, tell, tell us what you are thinking right now. What have you experienced earlier? What what is the journey so far of you viewing the World Cosplay Summit from a remote place? The, um, from generally, well, um, I have to be very honest with you, Jay. This is the first time that I was following WCSPH via stream because, because in the previous years, during the time of uh, Team Eureka and then Team Star Seeker and in Team. A Symphony of Swords. Sa Twitter lang ako nag-follow and then yung sa, sa ibang, yung sa World Cosplay Summit Philippines lang na page ako nag-follow. But this is the first time that sa stream ako nag-follow. And so far, uh, general impressions for this year, it's it's epic. <laughs> like, um, actually, medyo na, eh, parang it's a bit of my pag- majority of what I'm feeling is nostalgia wave. Because like people are cosplaying characters from yung mga previous like yung mga nostalgic franchises like well like for example in the case of Team Mexico it was Street Fighter and na actually I had to pull out yung had to like went through my archives to find my Street Fighter games after the after 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 the stream because I suddenly miss playing the strip the old Street Fighter games. And then medyo na fan girl ako ng contage sa ano sa my yung sa yung sa clamp clamp series. Specifically sa nakalimutan ko yung team but they cosplayed uh characters from X ninety nine. It's actually a very it's a very old clamp work and uh, I think it was before CCS or during the time when CCS, our uh, card captor Sakura was still ongoing, but fam, it's it's clamp fam. Medyo nag-spaz talaga ako because 
high school memories coming back to me. And then I'm actually very happy then that someone, a team is doing CCS card captor Sakura that is not Sakura and Shaoran for a change. It was Sakura and Yue. And yeah, it was it was pretty cool. And sa ano, grab it, uh, Team Mexico. Hindi pa ako nakarecover sa Team Mexico. Grab it. It was just so epic. Yung know, yung sa comments sa ano sa nikita mo sa sa comments sa Nico Nico. They were like, is that a is that a boy or a girl? Di ba di ba? Yeah, like especially if you haven't seen yung parang intro video nila. Mm-mm. Like. Oh, like if they didn't saw the interview or they missed that interview video, they're probably asking, "Is that a boy or a girl?" But man, they really nailed it, fam. Like, oh my god, yung near automata skit though, that team that who did near automata, grabe. Sabi nila 15 minutes, uh, kasi after bef- uh, after sa performance nila, I think my 15 minute break at tayon, and then sabi ko after. 15 minute break pero yung puso ko durog na durog because i don't want to spoil about the game but it's that part where it's uh they portrayed a part of the game which is incoming feels like she this actually me and my friend in fb we were like we were feeling the same because like like, this even this even legit like my feels my kokoro durog na durog but yeah that was probably one of my favorite skits in WCS aside from Team Mexico and yeah and sa yung sa entries yung sa first entry di ba correct me if I'm wrong Jay, Costa Rica is it's their first ano ngayon di ba yeah, Costa Rica <clears throat> Bulgaria and uh, uh what was the what was the other one again? South Africa. Ah yeah, I think Costa Rica did Black Butler, deba. Correct me if I'm wrong. Bulgaria. I love their skit, fam. Like yung sa yung sa pag change sa costumes yung sa transition, I like that one. And it was it was it's their first time as an entry, and they they really nailed it. Okay, what else? Um, That's so gay. Mm, yeah. So gay. <laughs> yeah. Yes, yes, it's gay. It's a gay. I know, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So and then hmm. um yeah. Uh what else? Oh yes, of course, Team Sakai. Uh grab it. I like alam mo yung yung when I was watching the stream and then it was already Team Philippines. Yung, yung parang like your heart was beating so fast and then intense pa yung skit nila. That's how, that's how I felt kanina. And mm-hmm. grabe, Serio and Kai nailed it. Grabe. Mm-hmm. Like, mm-hmm. congrats, Team Set Kai. Yes. <laughs> you guys. Oy, may, pa- wel- may pa-heroes welcome kayo, ha? Babalik kayo dito sa Philippines. May pa-heroes welcome kayo. Kailangan yan. Kailan ng heroes welcome, guys? <laughs> yeah. So, um... Um, anything else on your side? It's pretty good that people are venturing into other methods in like doing cosplay performances and uh yeah. And I'm actually medyo happy din ako to see Team China again because he actually since so last year sila din yung bet ko like in the last year. So yeah, they were Epic yung skit nila and something and seeing them again with their with their with their cosplays and stuff. Ah, uh, I'm so happy. Mm-hmm. But all in all, yeah. Um, epic, epic, ano? Uh, epic WCS and hopefully 2019 is going to be even better. So yes, uh, congrats team Sakai, grabe. Yeah, yeah congrats din sa team Mexico. Um, here are the things that I've seen ko sa ano this year's WCS ano. Ayan. So China had this blood substitute last year, but I think that's one of the reasons why they won. And this year, I've seen it being done by five teams. Five teams. Grab it. Mm. Also, this is not the WCS anymore. This is Fate Cosplay Summit. Because out of the 36 teams, four of them cosplayed characters from 
The Fate series. Nasu verse The Fate Fate Cosplay Summit. Okay, ikaw na po si Muno niyan eh. Ikaw po si Muno niyan eh. Feel, yeah, like, feel, mag, feel ko nga eh. I feel ko nga mag, mag-roll nga ako ng ano, baka makuha ko na yung SSR na na servant na gusto ko. <laughs> yeah. Pero, ilang teams yun? Four? Or Four. I lost count. Uh, yeah. We have oh two Fate Apocrypha, two Fate Grand Order. To think Then, that there mm. is uh, to think that there's Azure Lane ha sa WCS. Azure mm. Lane has a Azure Lane has awards. Pero uh, mm. aside from yeah. aside from the nostalgia no, you mentioned X, you mentioned Street Fighter. Mm. Why not Doraemon? Uh, yeah, Doraemon. Uh, yeah, Doraemon. Ah, yes. Ang ang pansin ko lang yeah, sa Team Vietnam, of course, um um seriousness aside, bakit parating umiiyak si Doraemon doon sa skit? <laughs> Uh, yeah. I, 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 it's it's really hard to get that uh, costume going, you know, especially the Doraemon, you know. For some, for, uh, a, for a, uh, I think uh, Vietnam has joined just last year, and for uh, such country, their cosplay community seems to have improved well. If we are to reflect on the skit that has been done earlier. Uh, Ayon. Yeah. Um, aside from that, uh, we also had. Um, if um, are you aware of this title called Scissor Cro- uh, Crown? Scissor's Crown? Yung entry ni oh, China no. Plaza? No, oh. I haven't. I'm not really familiar with it pa. Mm. So, oh. ayun. Kasi Scissor's Crown has been uh, done by teams China and Russia. Eh. And I was looking online, what is the Scissor's Crown uh, thing? I can only see one character, it's Klaus Hein. And I, I I I still have no idea about it. I don't know if it's a title, but it's a Japanese title, lah. I don't know if it's a uh, it's something else. Oh. Um, running down to the, at, may mini automata cosplay tayo, may scissors crown. Okay, so there's uh, another series that has double entry here, Monster Hunter series. Mm, yes. Uh. Uh. The cosplayed uh so series is. There is one team that cosplayed series from Monster Hunter X or Monster Hunter Generations. Mm-hmm. And then the recent game, which is Monster Hunter World, mm-hmm. which uh, which was done by Team Thailand. And then they won third place, which mm-hmm. I'm very happy as well. Uh-uh. Mm-hmm. But, and it's... it's Medyo relatable din yung ano. I, I like yung sa ending ng... Yung sa end ng skit nila. Kasi yung sa bomb. Ah, oo. Oo, oh, oh. oh, oh, yung fail. talaga yun eh. And, uh, Wala, na-finish yeah, na. Yung pag ano ng... Yung sa screen na may mission fail. Oh, so, oh. Parang parang war war flashbacks. Kasi na, relatable kasi sa mga players. And I play Monster Hunter World, so... Tawagin nga natin yung isang taga-team deathmatch. Eh, diba, diba yung taga-team deathmatch? Uh, yeah. Oo. Oh, oh. Pakita natin yung video. Pa-flashback natin sila. Hello darkness, my old friend. <laughs> yeah. Yung tayo. Eh. Ayun. So yun, yun nga. Um uh setting those aside, um I've seen uh, I'm going to browse over the titles. Um I'm aware of Cardcatcher Sakura Zelda, uh, mm. Bloodborne, Bloodborne. You aware of this? Bloodborne. I've heard of the name but I haven't really got into the franchise though. Uh is that is I'm not sure. I think that's a game series or novel. But yeah, I am not really that familiar with it. Mm, okay. So, Land of the Lost Truths, first ng uh, Malaysia. Malaysia. Yeah, Land that's... of the... Oh, they, they, this is the first time I've seen Land of, Land of the Lost Truths. Um, the anime has just aired two seasons ago, if I'm not mistaken. Or one season. Mm. Mm-hmm. Jose Kinokuni. Yung mga diamanteng tao. Ah, yeah. Oo. Oh, oh. oh, recent yan, Fighting di ba? Mali- uh, yeah. I like how yung sa, yung sa hair ni na, uh, yung, yung sa hair, like, ni Foss? they shine. Oo, oh, oh, si Foss. Especially Foss. Uh, Ayun. Was, was good. Was good. Mm-hmm. Uh, how was it? Well, uh, I haven't really got into the series yet. 
to be honest with you, Jay, I actually have mas grabi pa yung backlogs ko. But uh, if this is about yung skit sa Team Malaysia, I like how shiny the hair is. And and to think na, I, I guess the reason why I wasn't really familiar with it because it was a recent anime series. But yeah, it was it was very good. Though I haven't, I have no knowledge about the series yet. But I was able to understand their skit. And I think that's, that's really... That's really should be the ano Jano like like when you do skits for WCS is though though like of course it's understandable that a lot may not know about the franchise but at least with your skit people will get it at least the gist of it. Mm-mm. Um required talaga sa Jose Kinokuni cosplays na shiny ang buhok because the oh, diamonds yes. th- themselves uh-huh. shiny talaga yung buhok nila and it's a CG anime. Oh, it's a good, although it's a, it's it's like him on a friends, good CG. Mm. Ayun. Okay, I learned something today. <laughs> ten, 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 ten. Yeah. <laughs> now you learn. Yeah. <laughs> then the more you know. Ayun. So um, the, okay, let's move on to the other titles. Madoka Magica, done by. Uh, yes. done by Team India and for the first time nagreact ako ng maigi because you know if you know the plot of Madoka Magica as a whole from the series down to the other movies you know what's up you know what's up and they just summarize that in one move in one performance in those two minutes they just summarize that in two minutes 30 seconds <laughs> Yeah, Deva. Like me, me I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> I remember. I remember the Nessa Berry, my friend, ano. Uh, ganyan din yung tawa niya. <laughs> Imagine Nessa Berry laughing like that. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually. It was what what I really like about Team India skit was like. It was like the entire Madoka series. In a span of two minutes thirty seconds. Two minutes to thirty seconds. And look, and look, like, and look, Homura. Yes. Homura. Yes, ho- yes Homura. Yes, Transformation on the stage. My God. Yes. If the, yes. Maingay ako ngayon. Maingay ako ngayon. <laughs> yeah, actually, actually, meron din nag meron din nag react yon sa comments. So like, yeah, yeah. Yo. India. Yeah, yo. Why? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But come to think of it, in that culture, Madoka is uh, uh, surprise. It's surprisingly Madoka is there despite of the culture, ng India. Pero I don't think it's. Ano, it's. Uh, I think it's a different yeah. case, man. I think uh, ano lang. I think there was just a problem with the transition transition sa clothes or something. Or I'm not sure if it's the clothes that is the issue. Kinakabahan or... ako noon, mare. Ako yung kinakabahan, hindi sila. <laughs> ako, ako nga, ako nga eh. Let's like, take a lang, take a lang. Wait, 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 wait. And I was with the comments. It's like, fam, teka, teka, wait, please, teka. What is happening? What is happening? What, 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 what? <laughs> like, that was me. Like, na shook ako fam. Kinakabahan ako. Fam. No, you're not shook. I'm shook. Like, <sighs> Gabi. It was a good skit, but yeah, it needed work on that part, though. Oh, they, they can work on that part. Pero yun nga, I will never forget Team Inja after that. Uh, yeah, I no, uh, I, I can't get that memory off that. Uh, those few seconds of my head fam like five to ten seconds di ba yun? yung du- duration yun the duration yung of the yun? transformation homura transforming into something some to, to a dominant person you know yeah yeah, yeah. So, yeah. that's actually how homura does it eh I think yeah uh, I, oh, I don't I don't want to think about is, it homura is not supposed to be a shy boy Angas Ay. yan eh. Mababangis yan yeah. eh. Mabangis yan eh. Yeah, yun nga eh. Astig pa. Uh-uh. Okay, so the, here's one. Go Princess Precure. Australia. Oh. Yeah, yes. Yes, yes. And actually, I 
well, I have friends who are into pre-cure. Uh, si Kuya Henry is one of them. Oh, like, hi, the diehard, hi, diehard from Cosway.ph. Hi. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, Like what? Uh, I'm familiar with Precure, with the Precure franchise, because they're in the same. They're under the same company who made Sailor Moon, which is Toei. So I'm actually pretty happy that there are people who are doing Precure, and I'm actually very happy that the two people in Team Australia, the people who did that, were diehard fans of the series, which is pretty nice. Mm. Like, it, makita, it, it, oh, mo sa skit nila. Oh, So, kasi I just started like uh, getting into Go Princess Precure and like makita mo sa skit nila that like the love of the series is their fam. Like it it was good. It was good. Pretty nice. Mm. All right. So okay, let's move on to another title, Black Axe Shooter. I for what was this team Netherlands? Tama? Yeah. Uh I think so, yeah. Mm. All right, Team Netherlands. Uh, anong, anong, what was Black their Rock series? Shooter. Black Rock Shooter. Ah, uh, Black Rock Shooter. Uh, okay. Um, Deadmaster and Black Gold Saw. Uh, I think yung backdrop nila is, I'm not sure if yung backdrop, it fell off. But it would have been... Kasi I've, I'm a Black Rock Shooter fan and I was expecting... Like, mas grabe pa yung impact if it was Dead Master and the Black Rock Shooter. Mm-mm. But, yun talaga yeah, yung was... Yuri, yun talaga yung Yuri Father natin eh. I ship yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know me, J. Hehehehe. Hehehehe. Dili ako naging yeah, Yuri uh... fan kung dili ko magamay iyan. Yeah. But, well... Na, sa yung sa no, I have nothing yung sa uh, sa case ng ano ng Team Netherlands it was good for it, BRS franchise yeah, it was good but it I think needed more action and in sync and it would have been better if it was BRS and Deadmaster kasi may ano sila eh may because the the, the story plot was since we're talking about the OVA and the anime uh, in the anime Mm-mm. Kasi silang dalawa talaga yung may parang ano, yung parang may canon na uh, plot Mm-mm. of sorts in in the entire franchise. Si, si Black Gold so is parang later na during the anime, yung sa anime series na so there's not much um not much has been revealed about her way back. So yeah. Well, it was good. It was good, not bad. Mm. All right. Um okay, next title, Singapore Crisis Core Final Fantasy 7. What do you think? Uh, uh, let's see. This is this is the one with Sephiroth, right? Crisis. Yeah. This is the one with Final Fantasy Crisis Core. And Genesis. Um, the, yung makata. Uh, yeah. Um. The the yung wig lang yung may ano. The wig needs work. Yun lang. Hmm. Ano napansin ko don? How they did the parang di ba babalik sa ano? Among the uh uh in the the parts a few seconds before it ends, Sephiroth went back to some place, stepped mm. on the step on the floor. Tapos uh parang ano parang curtains was raised up. What did mm, they? Uh, yeah. That was that was good. That was good. Yeah. Mm-mm. That was good. Mm-mm. I parang I think nagwa gumawa sila na pabigat on that. Uh, they did the uh, a Uh, I don't know. It's, it's not a paperweight. It's a, a curtain weight. And then once it's triggered, it g- goes back up. It fe- falls down, mm. goes back up. Um, uh, mabalik tayo sa Netherlands, no? Sa Black Rock Shooter. No? I forgot this, ano? Considering that Netherlands mm. is the land of tall people. Mm-hmm. And Black Rock Shooter is actually not that tall. Yeah, it's Maybe, small. Oh, she's, yeah. she's small. Ayun, uh, so I think that's uh, that they have basis to do so. Kasi if if uh, oh, yeah. much better siguro if they did that with that plot instead of the tall black rock shooter. It will be like, mm. ano eh, I don't know. It will be indifferent. Pero yun nga, that's how they did it. Um, Guilty Gear Exerd Rev 2. Uh, Guilty Gear, oh yes. I, I, Team Sweden, right? 
Mm. Yeah, it was good. It was good, fam. Mm-mm. Persona 5. Persona 5, that was also nice. Though I haven't really played the game yet. I haven't had the game yet, but damn, that was good. Mm. And to think that those two are ladies. Magkapatid yun, ha? Magkapatid yun. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, how about Team like Chile? Them. Team Chile, Kurage Hime, Princess Jellyfish. Uh, uh, Kurage Hime, this is the one with yung... Disco. Yung this is the Chilean the Michael, disco. Yung the mic loss. Yeah. The, yung mic loss set. Yeah. Yung mic loss set. Yeah. Uh, ah, yeah, Chilean, that was actually mm. pretty good. It's, it also has the Chilean disco. Kat narinig ko yung tugtog nila, it's disco. Let's see. Uh, let me try to refresh. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, yun pala. That's the that's the team pala. Yeah, I like the how yung sa yung t- transition and then there was a bit of dance or something. That was pretty nice. Though I'm not sure if you noticed the comments, Jay. Because there are times yung time na I na nasa skit na sa ano uh, team Chile, de ba? Oh yeah, on the time na during the stream na when Team Chile was already playing, parang I turned on the comments, yung parang stream, yung comment stream. And then I noticed na merong nagsasabi daw na um medyo I I, I rose an eyebrow about it kasi sabi daw nila na parang copycat daw sa isang uh yung sa former down na teams yung isang former team before it's like uh i can't really confirm but maybe it's just probably coincidence ng siguro and i'm pretty sure that they are na grabe na yung yung effort on this team in doing the skit and something like that so i can't really say that they really co- copied the whole skit or something hmm. here's here's the thing That method, di ba yan that way? How they twirl around, be, tapos di ba yan pinihila yung tela just to transform her? That has been done by previous teams before. And that is a standard, yeah. if I'm not mistaken. That has been a standard. Once it's in the WCS, it will be a standard. That's my rule of thumb. You know, the blood substitutes, standard. The acrobatics, yeah, standard. That has been a standard before. So telling them that uh, it's a copycat of uh, other teams, well, you're if uh, mawalang galang na ano, with all due respect, uh, we're not on the same page. Yeah, ako, actually, to be honest with you, I can't really, really even say that it's really like it's really a copycat. Siguro I was just reading the comments. It's like, no, I don't think so. Well, I haven't really seen the said skit in question kasi they mentioned yung sa team, yung name ng team, and then the year. So so I have to check that out. Is But that team you I say? I don't really believe. Oh, so I don't really think that it's it's copycat or something. I don't think so. Like in I believe that it's not it's not a copy or something. Hmm. Kasi kung copycat yan, malaman ba't hindi yan pinayagan yung ganyan skit yan sa ano. Of course, they rehearsed for that. And I chances are, it's either, kung, 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 kung copycat yan, bakit walang nag-complain sa iba't ibang teams during the rehearsals? Or yun, was, yun nga eh. That's the point. O, ba diba? Bakit yan pinalampas kung ganun? Yeah, it would have, it would have passed first sa ano, sa... Would uh, WCS people would like raise they a will, flag about that? But they so far, they, they were able to perform that. Oh, no, they yeah. Were, yeah. Regardless, yeah. regardless, kasi last year, last last year lang sila sumali, di ba? Yeah. Oh. Ayun. So that's on our case. Uh, what I can tell is that we're not uh, we're not both on the uh, on the same page. So okay. Um, Atelier Sophie, the Last team to perform, Team Germany. Ah, uh, yes. Um, uh, I haven't, man, I'm I'm not really familiar with the franchise of uh, of the series that they were cosplaying, but I love the costumes. It was it was good and the music was very nice. What really captured me on on their skit was the music. Mm, actually, there's an if I can recommend you a series, 
um, this is not the exact series, but this is a part of the franchise. Atelier Esca and Logi. Watch it. May pandagdag ka sa backlog mo. Ayun, Atelier Esca and Logi. Oh, okay. Oh my God, marami akong backlogs, Jay. <laughs> so, okay. Um, siguro yun na muna yung mga teams natin, no? On my side, I really like how the transformation, kumbaga, there's this part sa Atelier Skit, in which of course you will put the head in there uh you will mm-hmm. put ano, tapos magic counting magic the other cosplayer was sitting on that part and then magic and Zeus, of course and all that uh i really like that magic trick of sorts kasi di ba from a mannequin it transformed into a human kumbaga it's um the 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 thing here is that the alchemist is doing uh soul trans ano, kumba, what they call it in full metal alchemist um, uh, their trans tra- transmutation tra- yeah transmutation mm. and they, and wala ako na ano they, they ano, really Ooh. Yeah. okay Yan. So, yeah, that's that's one good thing, you know. So, that's uh, among the few things na napansin ko sa WCS. Although, of course, hindi natin papalampasin ang WCS without talking about the gaffes. Um, ang pinaka-noticeable is Team Korea, unfortunately. Yes, oh, the actually the the wig was uh, the, the armor part of the armor was off, the wig was off, so Oh boy. And the, that the is armor, why the wig, is wig security is key, is always important. I don't, kung, kasi, kasi before, I, well, I used to cosplay before, but usually ang prior ko talaga is not, is making sure na hindi ma fall yung wig. Kasi, yeah. Mm-hmm. Here's another thing. I After the performance na dito rin, di ba? Of course, um, there's this standard uh, can questions, ano? But uh, I did, I, It felt awkward to me that uh, the MC still asked the question, uh, "Are you happy with your performance?" Eh, may nangyari na nga. So, um, yeah, yeah. But pero that's that's a lesson for the MCs na. That's for the MCs na. Um, another thing is yung sa Thailand. Of course, there is miscommunication. Miscommunication ensues, and for the third placer, Thailand, ang yush ang conversation nila. They wanted something like this. Um. Uh, are uh, are you tired? Tapos pinapaulit uh, yung tanong. Are 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 you tired? Uh, Thailand. Oh. So don't na napunta uh, yeah, discussion. I noticed that, that as well. That was uh-huh. that was a funny dis- uh, that was a funny exchange of words. Oh, and actually, well, for me lang ha, I think it would have been better like if they like um parang like each of the representatives will give. I like parang they have already provided them the possible questions that will pop up after their performance siguro just so that they'll prepare mm. and then also it will also para ma-relay nila sa sa kanilang translators or something like that para at least walang walang miscommunication or something like that ano or awkwardness and all that and all that she's Alright, so ano, ano pa ba napansin mo ng mga kalakohan sa WCS? Uh, yung parang ano lang, yung parang parang mistakes or something. Yung, everything, uh, everything. Uh, mistakes, gaps, uh, funny accidents. Oh, okay. uh, yun ano lang, yung parang noticeable ko lang is yung nung nahulog talaga yung backdrop. I've noticed this sa ano sa sa skit ng yung sa Black Rock Shooter. I'm not sure if it was really part of the skit, pero na, na, nahulog talaga yung backdrop or it was really part of it. But anyways, parang, um, yan na, nahulog yung backdrop. And I also noticed with, uh, pala J, yung sa backdrop is supported by PVC pipes lang. I'm not sure if there is, uh, di, I'm not sure, correct me if I'm wrong, J, yung sa WCS is specific talaga sila sa when it comes to like the materials used on like on weapons on backdrops diba mm, i don't think so kasi the, this year's rules have changed diba wala na tayong observer status wala na tayong observer status they didn't even mention that 
they mentioned that there are three new countries. There are 36 teams that will be competing, competing with emphasis. So, I do think that these things will change. Um, as for the materials, ang sinusukat lang naman dun is yung height at saka yung width eh. Kung gaano kataas eh. Because it's double uh, yeah. standard na eh. For materials, they can do whatever they do. Almost. I think it would have been when it comes to the support part ng backdrop nila. It would have been like, parang more weight like wood or something. Pero kasi kung sa PVC, kung PVC ang lang nag-support yan, there are chances na mahulog talaga yan. Mm-mm. Kasi it's, uh, it's lightweight and all that. Eh. But uh, you're, you have been co- you have cosplayed before eh? and I take to this account that you have the experience of doing so. Tama? Uh, please continue. Ah, uh, yeah. Oo. And uh, kasi, well, I guess, yeah, I think it's probably one of the challenges siguro. For for the representing team, Siguro and all that, because I, I remember, I remember, yung sa case ng Team Spain last year. Mm-hmm. Parang the one who did ano uh, berserk. Mm-hmm. They weren't able to execute their skit well, because parang ah yun. I remember that. I remember that last year na ano. That was sad. Yeah, the, I know. Like, ganda ng costumes nila, ng, nila eh. Yung, back, yung backdrop lang talaga. And I think, uh, tinapos nila yun, ano? Tinapos ba nila? Yeah, yeah. Okay, they were able to finish it, pero hindi na sila nakipag-usap sa mga MCs. That was that time. Yeah. Bigla ko naalala yeah, yun. Yeah, oo. Bigla ko naalala yun. Yeah. Actually, uh, no, they were able to talk, pero like, parang yung nag-cosplay ng Guts, parang nag-show na siya ng gesture na he doesn't want to to speak anymore. Ah, he doesn't oh, want oh. to go into other questions anymore than they left. Oh, oh, oh yun, 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 uh, yun. Mm. Uh, yeah. Right. So, yeah, um, that is for the World Cosby Summit, ano. Um, the uh, I've list uh, I've uh, live tweeted this on Twitter. Na thankfully, I was able to get it. Um, Air Asia Award goes to Team Mexico. Can you uh, Can you count with me? Uh, Brother Award goes to Denmark. Azure Lane Award for cosplay production is Indonesia. Uh, Laguna Ten Boss mm. Award for performance. Top performer nila Mexico. That's two. Mm. Futaba Award for Friendship Third Award for Mexico Grabe Rain Award for Style and Taste Mexico then. That's their fourth, no? Yeah Fourth, okay Air Asia na mention na mo? Yeah uh. Alright, Spearhead uh. Award is Vietnam Of all the countries This is the Team Na nagustuhan ng mga nanonood sa Oasis 21 of all the teams. So, uh, it's good. Nico Nico Award, Mexico. Yeah. How many awards yeah. now Mexico has? From Air Asia to Nico Nico. How many? Three, three to four? Okay. Five yata eh. Wait lang. Ah, uh, yeah, five, five. Okay, Mexico yeah. one, Mexico two, Mexico three, Mexico four, Mexico five. And... Grabe. They got the champions place. They are the champions. Six awards. Mm-hmm. And one day. Halos yung Team China last year, if I remember correctly, Jay. Sa case ng Team China, halos din they were able to get all almost all of the awards, de ba? Mm-hmm. So yeah. from from my observation here, what I'm learning so far in WCS, looking at the titles, looking at the things, is that this year. Team Mexico has won by nostalgia. The surprise yes. factor, the, spe- the the visual effects, so on and so forth. Um, yung bonus round talaga, yun. That was good. Yung bonus round, grabe. It was like, take lang. <laughs> Childhood memories incoming, grabe. Mm-mm. Parang malaking, yung sa bonus round, J, yung feeling na in nostalgia wave. <laughs> Mm-mm. Like, God, so many good memories, fam. So, 
yun ano, and uh, that's uh, naka limang awards na si Mexico. naka na. Kasi they also got yeah. the ticket to Monaco International Cosplay Masters and the Ministry of Foreign Affairs yeah. Award. So, yeah. all in all, yeah. six, seven, right? Yes. Ayun. Mm-hmm. So, I, I don't know. The, the trend is changing. It's either you introduce something new or you introduce you get people back to nostalgia um wala pang wala pang secret ingredient in winning WCS it still builds, uh, it still builds on character it still builds on the uh, the character the attitude kumbaga this is the reason why my uh, colleague al has said that WCS is the Miss Universe of cosplay malamang sa malamang mm. we are So far, but yet we are so close. The Philippines is so far yet so close on getting top three spots or even the awards. Uh, mm. po, maybe it's something else, pero we will still have to learn a lot. And this is the reason mm-hmm. why I'm going to continue observing the WCS from the sidelines. Uh, mm-hmm. ayun, on your end, what do you think of the this year's championship so far um for well for me well i have to agree with you on on the nostalgia thing they won by nostalgia and i think well considering last year team china grabby intense yung ano diba like mm. it was parang action pack yun so yung sa ano i think it really boils down siguro jay that it's something new on the table yung style siguro ng pag ano yung yung transition ng skit or something then i don't know I, it's really hard to explain but i guess it boils down that at least you give something new on the table siguro mm. all right In a so way. okay okay can we get back to the nico nico prize kasi i have um, mm. i was able to screenshot the eight countries that uh, were chosen ano Uh, yung mga top mm-hmm. yung mga top nila um, from those mm-hmm. eight pinapili sila kung sino yung mananalo and that was team Mexico so we'll go back to Mexico Thailand France mm-hmm. UK Indonesia Kuwait Kuwait did cosplay Neo you aware of it? Neo? Ni- Neo? yes oh yes mm-hmm. nice yung skit ano, nila and I like the costumes oh, oh. Mm-hmm. they even got a resounding ano ah They even got a crowd cheer. Yeah, di ba? Mm-mm. For for that kind of and that and, Kuwait is all Kuwait also joined last year. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, they weren't able to join last year. Mm, two years ago, I guess. Ah, okay. Kasi alam ko, okay. Hindi hindi sila bago. They're not new to WCS this year. Eh. Mm. Mm, siguro wala pang na ano na okay. ano. Ayan. Okay, uh, moving on Vietnam and Denmark. Uh, Denmark won the mm. other prize for the costumes. Mm, this is anong kina cosplay nila? Mm, was this card cutter sa akin? Denmark. Oh, no, 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 I, no. Uh, I think si I think yung CCS was Italy if I mm. if I'm correct. Mm-hmm. Okay, wait. Um let's mm. browse to the countries. Ano, countries lang yung nailista ko eh. Grandia, no, not Grandia 2. Thunderbolt Fantasy. Thunderbolt Fantasy. Oh, okay. Oh, it must be I Thunderbolt really Fantasy. I heard of that. Ngayon ko pa lang nalaman 'yan. <laughs> mhm. Ayun, so Thunderbolt mm-hmm. Fantasy is the Gen Orobochi puppet thing. Oh. The action okay. puppets. Yun na lang, visual effects na doon, you know? Ah, oh, yeah. okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, interesting. Mm-hmm. I learned something today. I learned a lot of things today. Mm. Ayun, so um, ano pa ba? Uh, yun yan, no? uh, one thing I also noticed sa WCS, I realized that un- up now that the viewers on Nico Nico are not forgiving at all. No. They don't forgive. The, some, there were harsh, there were very harsh comments. I don't wanna, I don't wanna there, name, there's this, there's this, I don't uh, wanna, yeah. During Team Australia's skit, one comment said, no fat shaming. 
I mean, yeah. Yeah. They did their best. They like, did well uh, and then makikita mo lang no fat shaming. So what does this mean? We are just not that good in empathy. Tama. Uh, we, we, we like to sympathize, so but we're not good in empathy. Wala tayong malasara talaga, no? Eh, pero, WCS, yeah. uh, the, kaya nga sila nandyan because they're the cream of the crop, eh. Yung nga, eh. Mm-mm. Ayun. Then, then, naalala ko yung, ano, yung, uh, wait, what was that? What was that team? Ay, yeah, yung, uh, these, um, these commenters, parang, parang feeling ko na Pinoy yung nag, nag-comment yun. Bakit? Ano sabi? Sa Team Korea, sa Team Korea ito, sa part ng Team Korea, okay. nakita ko yung comments sa BTS, oh, pasarang hey, meron pang ibang, do not use BTS for likes. Like, oh my God, please, sa tingin, no. Sa tingin mo, bilang kapwa Pinoy, Pinoy lang ba ang gagawa niyan? Uh, ewan ko. <laughs> sa Team Korean, uh, yung sa, yung the comments yeah, nakita thing, ko rin yung comment na yung na BTS eh, pero it was like, ha? Huh? Ano? And then I just ignore it. Pero yung talaga, ano, um, mm. so, yeah. Uh, yun, yun yung mga napansin Thank natin kalokan so far. Yeah, then, um, I had to turn off the comments afterwards kasi, oh God, please, 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 no. This is, this is, this is WCS. I'm not here for seeing stuff like this. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Mm. Ever since then, hindi ko na nabasa na yun. Ever since yung sa part ng, ano, ng Team Korea, hindi na, hindi ko na na on yung comment stream. So, I just left everything as is. Mm-hmm. Ayun, um, also, uh, yun nga, no? Um, comments and all that. Um, someone on Twitter actually tweeted about it, ano? Sana man lang na moderate ng mga, yung, yung, ng WCS yung mga lumalabas na comments. Ano? But, I do I don't know if uh, they can do that right there, no? Uh, yeah, they can as, only kasi as, I, as far as I've noticed, parang may anonymity yung yung comments. Yung, Every, kasi mm. kung I'm not I'm not really familiar with how Nico, um, the Nico Nico Doga website talaga. Like it's been a while for me kasi the only time I go to Nico Nico Doga was there are, if there are new Vocaloid songs or music videos. But that was that was before. But Um, hindi ko fa- hindi ko talaga familiar on the uh, parang like how they do comments because as far as I know yung yung kung mayroong live yung parang mga live broadcast an- anonymous talaga yon or maybe I I'm wrong but kasi mm. kasi yung yung setup ko sa video kan yung kanina was hindi in- Di ba yung parang may, yung may string ng comments sa right? Di ba, Jay? Yeah, yeah. Yung ginawa ko is, I kept the video. Uh, yung parang na-full ko, ko yung video. And I got then, the full screen too. Yeah, I kept the comments. Oh, full screen, parang, no comments. Yung comment stream ko na lang, yung nasa, ano, yung nasa video ko na lang, na, um, I kept it on. Pero yung sa comment stream na on the right, hindi. So anyways, yeah. I'm not sure if there is, I know, if there's a way to moderate it. But uh, yeah, it's something to that it's something that Nico Nico has to go into then. Well, so, Nico yeah. Nico hasn't gone through that because usually the mga ganyang comments, eh, regardless if it's positive or so harsh. Yeah, tama. Mm. Mm. So yeah, can get but, in with when it. it comes to yeah, but in the case, well, this is WCS, and you know that this is an international thing. So I think this is something that Nico Nico has to consider as well. Because alam mo naman, padali, it's oh, it's easy for them to register and comment away. Yeah, until then we will not yeah. be until then we will not be able to. get some change because it's really hard to change the ano uh, well it's a youtube yeah, yeah. Nila yan, but they did that for like how many years how many years yeah, transition tama. it has birth pains i don't know maybe uh-huh. maybe something else so um on in the future wcs will have its um wcs uh one piece 
Cosplay King Grand Prix as part of the commemoration of the 20th anniversary of One Piece, the series. Mm. Um, yes. And uh, you, you said toy, di ba, before? You said toy during Precure. The judges are, yeah. some of the judges are from toy. One judge is from uh, toy animation. So, well, yeah. There there goes our our yeah. there goes our one piece. So um I'm expecting yeah. next year because they gave this uh they gave this uh away na no early in the process. WCS twenty nineteen baka gawin yeah. nila dito may mga mag one piece dito. If they did so they chances are baka ma mention din sila uh to be vying for the cosplay king grand prix um if uh yeah. Yeah, you know, there, there there's also this uh uh other event after wcs kasi na postpone to due to typhoon number 12 in japan oh, yung di ba okay. yung lagukos ano ba lagukos yun? sa laguna tenbosh oh it's go it's oh, it's moved to september okay. na oh, oh. So, parang all of them would have to go back uh, I don't, next month for that event? Maybe na. Maybe yes, maybe no. Kasi the thing is, naganap na yung launching sa Laguna Tenbosch before. It's just that hindi lang ginanap yung pang public na party. Mm, ah, okay. Mm. Where's, Laguna, where's, Lug- wait, where is Laguna Tenbosch located? Laguna. Maybe I might drop by there. Around Nagoya, I guess. Next month? Around Nagoya, I guess. Ah, uh, Nagoya. Kasi Nagoya naman yun, uh, di ba? Ah, uh, uh, yeah. It's near the uh, airport daw, eh. Yeah, I might... Near the airport. Yeah, I think... Yeah, maka, I think maka-drop by kami doon. Well, I'm not... I'm not really sure, but... Uh, yeah, I'm... Oh, yeah, I might... Have I told you, Jay, no? Na... Ay, wait. You read it. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm going to Japan. Hmm. So, yeah. Anyways, that. Yeah, never mind. Hmm. <laughs> I actually saw it on your Twitter. Eh. So I'll just be there for one week, but I'll try to I'll try to find at least like a, a few hours or so to drop by at Nagoya to see the venue of WCS. Oasis Twenty One. All those key places. Oh, Oasis Twenty One, yeah. mare, kuntahan mo. Oh, okay, okay. Mm-hmm. Oasis 21. Um, ayun, ano, so, I guess that's about it for our the discussion regarding the World Cosplay Summit. Um, to recap, we have learned that uh, winning the WCS is not dependent on a magic formula or a secret formula. It goes Wala with the talaga, trends. Eh. Pal- it's like Lotto. Mm-mm. Wala makapagsasabi mm. kung, manana, kung, ano, kung yung formula mo, it will work. Because, di ba nga, five teams have done the blood substitute. Grabe. And it's a standard and think, now. And I think as, f- oh, yeah, parang, yeah, parang yung standard ng, kasi, kasi I'm not really sure if, if yung sa style ng Team China has been used by sa previous teams before. But I noticed na yun, yun na ginagamit ng ibang teams sa ano like this year mm-hmm. kasi this is the first team china mas sumikat sa team china talaga yung ano eh i can attribute uh, well if uh, someone some team somewhere does it uh, pero nakita ko sa WCS team china i will attribute it to them because they started the trend yeah yeah yun nga mm-hmm. eh yung exploding blood din oh, oh. kanila din exploding blood oo oh, oh. ayun so yeah, um aside from that, uh there are no more com- ano, kumbaga, oh, everyone is a competing team na. Yeah. Uh-oh. When which is pretty awesome. Oh, wala na observer nations. The concept of observer nations was uh kumbaga, for for the sake of fairness na rin siguro on the part of WCS and other teams na okay sige, pasalinan natin to, competing team na to. Uh, kasi, of course, eh, hmm. nag-effort pa sila just to exhibit, hindi sila magpa-perform. Parang kulang naman yung effort na, I don't know, no, no. Kumbaga, it's not reciprocal. Hmm. It's not, it's not give and take. This one is give and take na. Yeah. Um, tapos, uh, hmm. yeah. Ano pa bang, ano natin? 
what I've learned so far this year, Team Mexico won by nostalgia. And it's yes. pretty important yes. because they have all the raves from the audience. Street Fighter um, to. Grabe. Last year, was there a Street Fighter team? Cost uh, skip? Wala. Mm, wala. Wala. Was there a Doraemon cosplay skip Parang, before? Wala. Or maybe they... Or maybe they pero baka plus points din yung ano yung yung track. Ah, si track. Si ano kung sino man yon. Um speaking of team Banana Cosboys no. Uh both hmm. kasi parehas naman dancer yun eh, model and all that. And yeah. so ba parang side hmm. nila and they they're both cosplayers. Uh pero yun nga no, great team. They the ano, Mexico has done it hmm, well. Great team. And I'm um last year sino nanalo, 'di ba? Indo in uh two years ago Indonesia won yes yes as a champion uh-huh. pero grabe yung sa ano even even until now j team indonesia yung skit ng team indonesia sa WCS two years ago is still fresh in my memory kasi di ba yung sila yung parang na split yung yung body di ba sila yun uh i actually forgot na eh. Yeah, but kasi may kasi it's like parang parang hindi parang hindi cosplay skit ang na ano yes it's a cosplay skit but they mixed illusions or something parang it, it's like it's like parang they were deceiving the audience or something and but it was uh, I don't know it was it's really hard to explain right now but until now it's that skit nila was really awesome kasi it had it had parang na split yung body into two mm. like half talaga like yung parang na slice yung, yung yung ano yung 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 torso mm. area even until now jay that skit is still fresh from mm. my memory like that was that was really epic that was that was really parang i think that also started the trend na parang yung parang may may substitute body or sorts as prop o para may para may yung parang cut effect or something mm-hmm. and cut bodies and all that stuff so yeah. that's my that's my that's my observation of Kung course Kung pansin mo sa skit ng Team Philippines during the end di ba si Kai as uh, Yuki Murasana da mm. uh, di ba yung parang no, no hinahati mm. na si Sergio as Nobunaga Oda mm. Uh, pansin mo, mm. di ba, parang naka-armor lang mm. siya and then makikita mo na lang may hati na yung katawan niya. Yeah. May cut na yung... Yeah. Ano. Like, that was, that was, that was really mm-hmm. cool, man. Like, yeah, props to Serio and Kai. They really uh, did they, a good they, job. They did a great job and they deserve a hero's welcome pagbalik nila. Um, I got a tip, I got a tip from Miss Joy sa... ng uh, Unbox na they'll be coming back August 17, which is next week. Next two weeks. Yeah. Ah, oh, oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's good. Mag-heroes welcome ako niyan. Pupunta ako yeah. sa kanila. Papar- sasama ako sa party nila. They deserve all yeah. the accolades yeah. from us. And walang napansin na, there's, I, I don't see anything na, ano eh, pinatay ko din yung comments dun sa video eh. He, 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 he. Pero wala naman ako napansin. Yeah, actually, eh. actually, wala. Wala na ako nag, ano, wala na ako nag ah there was this one ano yung sa yung sa stream meron din ako nakita na team Philippines ah uh, yeah uh, laban yes. Pilipinas there was there was one yes. so yeah that was that was good that was good fam feels good hindi fam. pa ako nakalagin here's, Pero, here's the yeah. thing Azarina hindi pa ako nakalagin sa Nico Nico Doga and yet the stream is stable as heck it doesn't cut me out it doesn't ano uh, um, except for a few hiccups, it doesn't cut me out actually, and it's good. Pero it's 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 good, but it's bad because buma in that case, di ba last year, um nagaharang na si Nico Nico, right? They got paywalls na eh. I don't know if it's a good thing or bad thing right now. Eh. I don't know if that will be the basis of me saying na medyo buma ba yung audience ng WCS. But no, I don't think it went down eh because they had dedicated the uh, dedicated yeah. viewing areas naman eh. Yeah. Si WCS na nang hanap ng mga so, ano eh. Yeah, ng mga uh, dedicated the viewing areas. Especially sa Belgium and all that. I don't know. Mm-hmm. 
I can so judge. So a case ng screen ko, I was having, I was having problems actually. That's why sa first, sa first part ng WCS, parang there were a lot of hiccups and I registered nga ako eh. I used my Nico Nico Dog account. Probably, I think it would have been better if I did, if I logged out or something, then just get this, just click on the link for the live stream. Siguro, I think that would have been, well, I don't know. Or maybe it's just my connection or something, but yeah. Meron din akong na, na-read na comments yung sa first part din. Um, there were hiccups on, yung parang lagi daw yung stream or maybe it's just their mm-hmm. connection. But the uh, PH connection, ha, 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 hello PH internet, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> oh, buti well. na lang, no, nasa labas <laughs> ako nun. Labas ako nun, then I checked it. So yeah, um, that goes for the WCS uh, right now. Next year, we'll do this again. Uh, this time, baka I'll, I'll, I'll watch from the sidelines. Hopefully, may humalili sa atin sa pag-string ng national finals. Because, for me, ginawa ko lang to because YOLO, yeah, FOMO. It, yeah, um, most likely, I have to be very honest with you, Jay. Like, next year, I also, um, considering of, like, covering the WCS as well because this, this is actually the, this whole experience for me this year was pretty interesting and and to think na diba we, we met mm-hmm. in Davao diba and I have to be very uh, yeah and I have to be very honest with you Jay the reason why I had to go there because I was I was really bored <laughs> I was really bored so I decided to just uh, uh, for the heck of it I'll just go to Davao and then um, I did not really expect much with WCS PH at first, but witnessing it live, like, like everything changed, and then like I finally made the decision, like, hey, I'm 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 also gonna like cover as well or cover from the sidelines as well and all that mm-hmm. stuff. And if ever mag we meet again for the national finals. Let's ask for better yes. internet. Mga <laughs> mag-reach tayo sa ano? Mag-reach tayo sa ano sa mga yung sa mga major sponsors yung sa na may wifi. Uh, asa tayo diyan. <laughs> <laughs> asa tayo diyan. Kanya-kanya kay KB daw. Ayun. Yeah. Right, so that's the mm. So go go go. The like well it was ah uh, grabe this this the Ano, uh, WCS 2018 was an epic one, grabe. Like, I enjoyed it from from the national finals, from covering the national finals to, to this one. And yeah, uh, Team Philippines, they've done a good job. And I, like, I'm so proud, fam. Proud of ni Seriot, ni ano, ni Kai. So like, yes, fam. Dude. Right, so that's the end of our uh, yeah. episode uh, yeah. 13. And uh, Serena, you can tell everyone what are you doing right now. Where can we find you? Okay, um, you can visit, uh, well, the my Facebook page. The name of my Facebook page is very long. But if you if you just type in the lily cat and if you see... AI, it's a black cat with a flower in the middle. That is my page. You can go like it. And the main, my main blog is www.thelilycat.com. And also, um, uh, I'm going to ng it with if it's all right with you. Oh, yeah. Uh, actually, I'm. if you love... Um, so Joe I or girls <laughs> love or yeah in the related genre. <laughs> Hi <laughs> Jay. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm inviting you guys also to like Yuri GL Philippines. Just type in Yuri slash GL Philippines the Facebook page, and if you check on the pin post, there's also a link to the official Facebook group. And just spoiler, just a spoiler, we will also be at Cosplay Mania. Uh, 2018 that is on 29 to 30 at SMX Convention Center. So, uh, yeah, 
Yuri is best John. See you on the 30th of September. <laughs> ah. I'll be there whole day sa cosplay yeah. niya. Uh, that was, that's on a Sunday and uh, I'm going to watch the concert of Fana and Megumi Nakajima. I'll be there actually. VIP uh, ako fam. VIP ka fam. <laughs> Boti ka pa fam. Yeah. Yeah. Ay. Yeah. yeah. Oo. So, second day ka na ng ano, Cosminia. Segunda. Oh, okay. Oo. That's good. Uh, it just sink into me Jane, uh, diba, I'm going to Japan for a week. Then the week after that, babalik pa ako ng, babalik pa ako ng Manila for cosplay mania. Like, oh my God, so, so busy. So many travels. Be well, ha? Be well. Also, yeah. si Takeuchi-san, pimit ng uh, mga idol masters. Tak- yeah. Si Takepi. Yeah. Yan. All right. So, um, this is Jay. You can find me always on Twitter, Jay Agonoy. Facebook, it's Keepsakes by Jay. And I'm releasing video content one by one sa YouTube. I still haven't done the last video, which is part of the Awaken the Werpa set uh, sa Love Live uh, Yoshiko Yo- oh. uh, Susima Party. So, yeah, please uh, wait for it. Sana hindi ko pa siya na-delete. At nandun pa siya sa backup ko. Uh, uh, yeah, in, uh, uh, yeah, in speaking of Twitter, uh, you can also follow me at Lily Kat Serena. So, yeah. Right, so this has been the 13th episode, the lucky 13th episode of Keepsakes, the podcast. We will hear you soon. Until then, be well. Yeah. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Stay, Stay awesome. awesome. Stay chill. Stay frosty.